I've got a huge surprise for you. See if you can guess what it is. Today we're going to have some fun with an image of a marquette. First thing I'm going to do is create a character. We're going to go down and get our little marquette. And that's our little marquette. And while we're in the composer mode, we're going to hit the face editor. And we want to create a morph based head. And we're going to go down and get the little head. Now, what I've done is I've taken the head of the marquette and actually just cleaned around it. This allows you to animate the head without having it affect the rest of the body. Now the animation comes on, and the first thing they want you to do is straighten it up. Well, she's nice and straight, so we're going to hit next. Then we have to do the eyes. Set the mouth. Then next. Now you have the ability to set the animation for the animal's face. I like to use the double one because you get a lot more access to the face. You can do a lot more to the face. Now I'm going to do the animation of the face and remain silent. And while I do it, that way I can speed it up. You can just watch it in fast mode instead of having to watch me do it slowly. Eyes closing and blinking. Up, down, left, right, and some natural movement. Eyes closing and blinking. Up, down, left, right, and rolling. A, E, I, O, U, and Meow. Smile, angry, sad, happy, surprised, and scared. Now that we have the face fitted, we're going to resize it on his head. Now we have to figure out what we're going to have him say. Okay, I think I've got it. So we're going to go and we're going to click on him. We're going to click on add a wave file. I've got a huge surprise for you. See if you can guess what it is. Okay, I think you should have guessed, or at least I hope you should have guessed. So what I did is I cut out his tail, and then I brought his tail in to Cartoon Animator, and I created uh, the bones so that it could move, and made it a separate character. And then I brought the tail in on top, and now we can move both so he can talk and have his tail move at the same time. Now all we have to do is add his facial features. So we've gone over here, and we clicked on the face puppet, and we're going to record, hit the space bar. I've got a huge surprise for you. See if you can guess what it is. And that's it. Let's see what we got. I've got a huge surprise for you. See if you can guess what it is. Think we got it. Hope you enjoyed this. Hope you learned something new. Have a great day, Diana.